Hi, it's Jenny, and I thought I'd pop on and do a stitch with me on European Town. I have done quite a bit tonight on 989, which is all this green, around here, around there, and around there, and up round here. So I've done quite a bit. It's certainly growing a lot, and that's so yeah, I'm doing all the dark pink areas. Now, where have I just lost my? Needle. There you go. There you go. Hiding behind. <laughs> so, yeah, it fell down behind. So, I'm stitching all the way up through here now. Let's move you up slightly so we can get you in the shot. Uh, let's see if that's better. Uh, so. Yeah, I've been happily stitching away on this tonight. And I thought, well, I'll do a quick little stitch with me. Uh, for one of them two comes down. And that actually it's already been down once. If you're in a bit, that's better. Uh, but, yeah. All I've done today is stitch. It's been nice. I've done some on the robin. Uh, seven great sent me. So I thought, well, tonight <coughs> it was staring at me. And I thought, yeah, I need to get you out and work on you. So I've done absolutely loads on this tonight. So I was quite happy. Uh, getting comfy. Well, I might oh, put my leg up on the sofa. So I've got to go Christmas shopping with mum tomorrow. Oof. Not looking forward to. Uh, I thought I'd be mad in town. Uh, she bought the new carving knife today. And I went, have you got the turkey? She went, do. <laughs> she can get that tomorrow. Well, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to go shopping tomorrow. Leave them two here. Uh we we'll do that. And I'm looking forward to the day, Christmas Day, to be over and done with me. Mm. The 23rd is the anniversary of losing me now a couple of years ago. And that's so, uh, yeah, I don't like that day. Mm. I should probably do stitching or something to keep my mind off it. But, you yeah, know. Uh, a lot of nice photos have been coming up on Facebook because round about now we always used to go up to London to go see her and the sherry trifle photos are popping up on Facebook that she used to make us when we go up you could get drunk on her sherry trifle oh it was really nice I just wish we had a recipe I kept asking her to write it down but she we never got to write it down I know she used half a bowl, well, not half a bowl, whole bottle of sherry to soak the cake, the Madeira cake, which she used to put in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They used to argue who was going to drive back. Dad and Mark, the brother. Uh, probably would have got breathalysed after that, that trifle. Mm. No, it got me drunk one year and had two portions. <laughs> yeah. Kira says we got a faff of that out to make it her way. I've got a photo and that. I'm going to suss it out. I've got her sherry trifle bowls. They were left to me. I've also got Dad's big silver spoon that she used to give him to eat with it. It was a massive spoon. And I was giving it. I was quite surprised about that. So I've got that. And I've got the bowls that go with the sherry trifle bowl as well. So I need to make one. We were watching Jamie Oliver uh, today, me and Kira, and he done a chocolate trifle. Ooh, that looked good. She said there was no booze in it, though, which was very disappointing. <laughs> But yeah, it did look good, it did look good, and, uh, but I want to suss me Nan's one out. 
Uh, I think I've roughly got an idea she's peaches. Uh, custard. Condensed milk got whipped up. I know that much. So yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out one day. Uh, we're going to make some mince pies. The mince meats appeared on the worktop, so that might be happening tomorrow. Uh, they won't last long. Uh, so, yeah, as I said on my uh, vlogmas, we've finished moving the furniture around. You, My room's all right. I've just got to cut, go through some books, sort out, get rid of. Uh, we've got to sort out. We said to Kira we'll do that room tomorrow afternoon. Her room, finish it off. We just needed a break because we've had three days worth of doing stuff. Uh, my thighs were like, yeah, no, not happening today. They ached. <laughs> they were going, oh. Uh. So we had a break today. She sat and watched YouTube. I watch YouTube. And i done a lot of cross-stitch and that. Uh, oops. I keep saying we're going to get snow. I don't know if we're actually going to... It's still a shot yet. I don't know if we actually are going to get snow or not. Because we've had nothing but rain. Uh, we reckon a lot of people in the UK are going to wake up to snow Christmas morning. Uh said to Kira we better get the pool couch just in case because <laughs> we did shopping in Tesco the other day they had loads of reduced meat in oh I was in heaven that's something falling down um yeah all my bottom freezer is filled up and uh, they had a joint of pork reduced from seven pound to under four pound so I thought ooh that's a bargain. Uh, do that in the air fry. Get some nice crackling on it. Uh, got some steak. So I said we'll have a casserole. Steak dumplings one day in a slow cooker. I'll get a dumpling mix tomorrow and we'll make some dumplings. And that's so uh, yeah, got quite a lot in. If we do get snow. I want to see it. I love it when it stows. Don't like it when we get stowed in though, but I like seeing it. <laughs> uh, when we had the beast from the east, we couldn't get out. We were stowed in. Courageous, felt like. Uh, been enjoying doing this colour. I've done absolutely loads this evening. No. Just fancy getting it out. I haven't done any for ages on European town. Keep seeing it pop up on YouTube. People are uh, reviewing it again. Uh, they're unboxing it and I'm like, mm, yeah, I need to get mine out and work on. I've had it for about two years, I think. I think. <laughs> I'm going to pull it away for a while. I didn't do any on it for yonks. Absolutely yonks, but then got it out again. Uh, and I've only got oh, that to do. <laughs> it's really long. It's bigger than me, this cross stitch. It really is bigger than me. It's a challenge and a half. Right, where am I? I've just done the half. Go the half. Get another bit of thread out in a minute. Uh, I've got it on the hoop today. I thought it's easier to do it on the hoop. Uh, got my cushion underneath, resting on. What's that in there? That's cut through there. I'll put that through in a bit. Let's get another bit of thread out, number 46. Uh, see if that will come out without it. Yay! Got it out. It's going quick now this week, and it? it won't be long before we hit Monday. I was looking to see 
on the Sky TV guide what was on TV on Monday and the only thing I want to watch is Doctor Who and that's it so yeah not much on might be watching something on Netflix and when we get back I won't be able to watch Doctor Who Christmas Day I won't allow it on well she'll allow it on but she yak through the whole ruddy thing and I'll be like I just want to watch it in peace <laughs> she did that one year to be a dad Oh, it drove us potty. We were watching that and we were watching Downton Abbey and she just wouldn't be quiet. Uh, so, yeah. We gave up. We watch it when, you know, later on when we get home in peace. Uh, so I could just watch it and not try and figure out what Mum's saying to me <laughs> in between. Because uh, we've got the new doctor. I'm going to see what it, you know, how he goes. I really like the three episodes we've just had. Kira hasn't watched it yet. I told her to hurry up and watch it. I said, you've got to watch it before Monday. She went, why? I said, you need to watch it before Monday. So I might try and get her to watch it down there on iPlayer. Because uh, she can't watch it at uni. Because she doesn't have a TV licence to watch BBC at uni. So... She was going to wait until she got home and she hadn't surprised she hadn't watched it yet. I told her it was really good. Right. There's a Call the Midwives special Christmas Day. I don't really watch that. Uh, I was planning on starting it from the beginning. So, you, you know, try and get through it. I've watched one or two episodes, but I haven't really... Watch the whole lot. Mm. Mum said she wants to watch Beyond Paradise. Quite like that. The one after Dead in Paradise. Was it Death in Paradise? Dead in Paradise from BBC. So yeah, we might watch that. And we'll be well home before that time. Only be kicking off by three o'clock. <laughs> it's normal time for leaving. I'm saying we're not leaving at three. <laughs> You'd be going, why not? I'll be going, it's Christmas Day. We're staying a bit longer today. Ooh, ooh, here you go. Oh, you didn't have, have a meltdown yesterday. Oh, my God. Two and a half hours screaming fit yesterday. Yeah. I had to walk away a couple of times. I just walked away and he kept um, uh, kept following me. I said, Chomik, what? Just leave me alone. Don't follow me. Stay upstairs. <laughs> I just said, don't. <laughs> I just wanted help with the furniture moved. He's a strong lad. Once he gets started moving stuff, he can really shove it. And, yeah, he's just don't want to do it because it's interfering his gaming and I couldn't even push the wardrobe let her try and trying to move it and Sean Luke just shoved it yeah with me at the front and me Kira at the back and he did a lot of the shoving but you yeah, know two and a half hours meltdown uh, we did it in half an hour mm. After that meltdown, so it took three hours all in all. <laughs> yeah, I had a couple of vodkas last night after that. I needed it. <laughs> and I said, yeah, no, I'm having a drink. I need one. I hurt one. <laughs> For keeping calm. <sighs> Not had one of them meltdowns in a long time. Uh, yeah, we certainly knew about it yesterday. Then right at the end, Kira just went, oh, I can't repeat what Kira said. <laughs> he started strategizing how to get it out and move it. And he did it within 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. 10 minutes. All that screaming just for 10 minutes. I was like, oh, dear lordy. God knows what the neighbours must have thought. Uh, yeah, that was a fun afternoon. Uh, 
Uh, at least it's done. All we're doing is just tidying up areas that I had piles of clues. I've you know, downstairs. I've gone through two wash loads. Then Shani decided he was putting a massive pile of clothes down. So yeah, I've got another mountain to do. <laughs> I'm like, yay, fun. So once they all dry, I'll put them out in the wardrobes because it's wardrobes in mine. Because then I know if it's on the floor in his room, it's dirty. It's got to be washed. If it's in my room, it's clean. Because I was washing it so much, I thought, no, I can't be doing with that. We've got a wardrobe in my room. <laughs> Easier. I know it's clean. He had some trousers turn up for vinted. I got him five pairs. Um, two pairs have turned up. He likes joggers. Uh, the pre marked ones. Um, they didn't have many in his size when we went in. So I looked on vinted. They had quite... Quite a few on there, so I've got five. Well, one order was three packs, three lots of trousers for seven pound, I think it was. I thought that was a bargain, so I got that. And then they had uh, a couple of other ones, so I went, okay, that'll do it. So I didn't spend a lot really, I was quite chuffed. And he's got some more trousers. And he put one lot of joggers on straight away today. Well, I like these. I said, they look nice, would not you? He said, well, my money goes in. Could we get some more? I went, yeah, I'll get another five lots. Because uh, they do look nice on him. Uh, Kira had her asthma appointment on Friday. So we got a, was it Friday? No, Monday. So we got to pick them new inhalers up on Friday. Um, she went down to get her flu jab and she had an appointment booked, but no flu jabs turned up. <laughs> I think they would have texted, wouldn't you? So she didn't get a flu jab. Uh, so we're waiting for them to text to say when they've got it in. And that's so. Hmm. Yeah. Gonna go down Friday. I said to Mummy, you coming down? She went, No, I'm going to a Christmas market. I went, Oh, that'd be nice. So they're going out. I missed the one at Salisbury this year. They didn't have one up there. Usually like doing that one. And that, that. Uh, probably. Have to go in Christmas Eve. I don't know yet. She hasn't said. That's a triangle. Let's go in that one. We'll be there Christmas Day. If no snow. Mm -hmm. Christmas Eve, I always get a prawn ring. In the evening, <laughs> so I need to get that Friday if there's any left. There usually is. And I go in Iceland and we have if it's if it's there to eat it. <laughs> yeah. A couple of their three for five pound ranges in there. They're quite good bargains, they are. I got a couple, well, I got one lot the other day for lunches. And Kira went, Oh, these are good. I went, Yeah, you need to get some when you go back. Fill your freezer up. And that she's put in for a couple of rugby days at Principality, so she's got a few days to be working when she goes back. And uh, once before she goes back, so she could do that one. I said just do all of them, it's shopping management, yeah. So she's put in for it. Let's hope she don't book one in March when she my in shop, yeah. When she goes to see Mother Mother. She's looking forward to that. I've never heard of them. I have to 
go and have a listen to see what they do. It'd be a, probably a metallic band, metal band or something. That's normally her thing. She likes Sabaton. She went and saw them in Cardiff. Yeah. Someone else she saw, I can't remember who it was. Another band. She enjoyed Madness. She said they were really good. She said she really enjoyed it. Her and Fred Vicky thought they were going to be the youngest one there. She said they were. She was last year when she went with her mum and auntie. And she said this year they weren't the youngest. She said there was someone there that was about 10. She said it looked like he'd been dragged. I said probably had been. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, at least she's seen quite a few bands. They got War of the Worlds there in 2025. She went, oh, I said, book a hotel and book it. I said, you really like it? Just book a hotel. She went, I think I might. I said, oh, you can beg, beg Vicky to go and stay there. Fly, go away. Uh, she loves the musical. Mm -hmm. I've done quite a lot today, quite pleased with what I've done on here today. I'm aiming to get all the pink done, all the bright pink. Uh, so yeah, I've got to do all the pinky areas on this one, this section. <coughs> uh, I've deleted a load of videos on the phone. Can't remember to go in the file section to see if there's any videos left in that bit as well. I deleted them in the recycle bin. So I keep forgetting to do that. Because mm. the advent calendar finishes on Sunday, but I might do every day anyway. I'll do some stitchy days or diamond painting days, carry on through the month. Keep it going. It's quiet. What's going on upstairs? <laughs> she might not have spoken too soon. Mm -hmm. Can you hear my brain think? Mm -hmm. That don't normally happen. I gotta get some mixed fruit tomorrow for Kira's little portable smoothie maker. Uh yeah, so I gotta get uh, some milk and some mixed fruit. I'll see what they got in I think we're doing Morrison's. See what they got in the I fancy a berry one. I might get a bag of berries. Get her a different one. See if she'll make me one. <laughs> we'll get her some oatly milk because she says the other milk makes her tummy upset. She had a hot chocolate tonight with it. So I've got a hot chocolate machine. The hotel chocolate. I said, well, that's a nice one. She said, that's a dark chocolate one. You don't normally like that. I went, no, but that's nice. I had a sip. Mum got a Costa cup. And she can't open. Faffing that how to open it. So Kira ended up with it. <clears throat> Kira went, that's the one I wanted when she bought it. I went, I know you ended up with it. <laughs> she does things like that. Uh, right, I think that's going to be it because I'm at the end of the thread, so I've done quite a lot. And all down, all down there, all down there today, and around there, around there. I've done all around there. So yeah, I'm going to do a lot. I'm going to try and do all the pink up there as well. So right, I'm going to go because um, I need a drink thirsty and I'm going to carry on stitching and I'm going to put on Ghost Dimension on YouTube they got a video up 
than that. So, yeah, I hope you'll stay safe and stay well and have a nice Christmas and I'll speak to you tomorrow. Bye.